Ah, Helene. So good of you to attend this evening. Of course, HG. I wouldn't have missed it for the world. The machine you've been going on about is here somewhere, isn't it? Yes, of course. I'm eager to show you all how it works. Please excuse me, Helene, while I greet the other guests. Oh, of course. Anthony, my friend, how good of you and your lovely wife, Violet, to join us. We're always happy to attend your gatherings, HG. They never fail to, uh, how do you say, excite? So, we need a big reveal. We're all so eager to see what you've been working on. Violet, you're looking exquisite this evening. Why, thank you, HG. You're too kind. Robert, welcome. Let's get a drink in your hand. Ah, oh, John, you've made it. I'm so glad you finally arrived. I apologize for the delay. I had an emergency surgery that wreaked havoc on my schedule. I didn't miss you showing off your machine, did I? Of course not. I was waiting for you to arrive, my dear man. Excuse me? If I could please have your attention, I would like for the gentleman to join me in the other room. Please, excuse us, ladies. The time has come for me to show you the machine I've been working on. Well, here it is. The machine I've been telling you about. Knowing my obsession with time travel, I'm certain you've all deduced that it's a time machine. I don't believe it. You bloody built it. I did indeed. How does it work? No need to bore you with details. Let's just suffice to say, with all the parts in their appropriate places, it will travel through time at a rate of two years per minute. It is a true. English is in my second language, but I can't even find the words in Italian. Where will you go? I believe what you meant to ask is, when will I go? When will you travel to? The future or the past? I will definitely travel to the future. When do you leave, old chap? I haven't concluded that. If I'm being completely candid, I haven't quite worked up the nerve. 